not met me. My name is Peter and I'm the Anglican Area Dean for Blackpool. Let's bow our heads as we start with a prayer. We meet in the presence of God. We commit ourselves to work in penitence and faith for reconciliation between the nations that all people may together live in freedom, justice and peace. We pray for all who in bereavement, disability and pain continue to suffer the consequences of fighting and terror. We remember with thanksgiving and sorrow those whose lives in world wars and conflicts past and present have, given, uh, have been given and taken away. The Lord is my shepherd, I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Let us confess our sins in penitence and faith, firmly resolved to keep God's commandments and to live in love and peace with all people. Almighty and merciful God, Lord of men and nations, we confess with, sh the sh with shame the sins, both private and public, by which we have broken your law and grieved your Holy Spirit. Lord, have mercy. We acknowledge the reproach that war has brought upon the name of Christ. We confess our lack of love for you and for our fellow men. Christ, have mercy. Teach us to forgive as we are forgiven, so that we may grow more like him and live our lives according to your will. Lord, have mercy. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, who in his great mercy has promised forgiveness of sins, to all those who with heartfelt repentance and true faith turn to him. Have mercy on you, pardon and deliver you from all your sins, confirm and strengthen you in all goodness and bring you to everlasting life. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Please, please would you stand? Let us remember before God all who have died as a result of war, oppression, and tyranny. They shall grow not old as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years come down. And the going down of the sun and in the morning we will remember them. <laughs>
Tell them of us and say, for your tomorrow, we give our today. Yeah, what a spectacular way to uh, to remember, and you can see the amount of people who have uh, come out on this uh, this very special day. Huge, huge crowds, and it's so nice to uh, to see everybody coming together.
despite differences and even religions to, uh, to mark this uh, very special Remembrance Sunday. So you see these little, uh, little speakers, they've been uh, sounding uh, the very, very special pieces of music. And uh, a fantastic, fantastic turnout, um, just to remember the, uh, the fallen. As we uh, look across the beach, Just remember of what they uh, what they sacrificed for uh, for us today.
Streets are now getting busy either side, and we're just waiting for the uh, for the march, which will be uh, coming straight down the uh, the promenade any moment. So I hope you enjoyed that special day on Remembrance Sunday. 
and uh, it's just nice to see how people come together in Blackpool to, uh, to remember um, everybody who made so many sacrifices for us to be uh, here today. So until next time, take care of yourselves and it is a bye from me. Bye bye.